A viewer wanted to know how he can handle his ex-girlfriend who has moved on. She's with a new boyfriend, but every time he sees her, she approaches him and flirts. All right. And he wants to know if he should try to get back together. No, 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 no. You need to move on. You need to allow her to move on. She's having a hard time. You're obviously having a hard time because the way you should be reacting if she comes up to you is back off, just be friendly, but don't flirt back and allow her to have this new relationship. You don't want to be the one to break it up. Obviously, there's some problems if she's leaving her boyfriend to come talk to you. It'd be different if you're all in the same group and she happens to see you, but it sounds like she's making a beeline over to you when she's with her boyfriend. Not a good sign, but still, you don't want to be the one to break up the relationship. And you could say, well, this is an opportunity to get back together. No, no, it's not. Because then, okay, say you just ruin their relationship, which may be going away on its own anyway. I don't know, but it's not up to you. So you tell her that you want to get back together again. She breaks up with this guy and you're back together. And then whatever it was that broke you up will rear its ugly head and you'll have the same problems that you did before. There's something, there's some reason that you broke up. So that hasn't changed unless you address the issue and really work on it. But I feel like you would have done that before. You would have tried to save the relationship. I don't think that normally, most of the time, when you get back together with someone, it works out. I mean, look at all these Hollywood marriages where they divorce, get back together, and then they get divorced again. Richard Burton and Elizabeth Taylor and Don Johnson and, Meth and Melanie Griffith. I, I, I mean, those are just a few. And I'm not saying that, that it can't happen because it can, but I'm just saying most of the time it doesn't. So think really, really long and hard about getting back together with your ex. And then you have to ask yourself why. Is it only because she's with someone? Would you feel the same if she weren't with a new guy? Would you feel the same if she were unattached and you're both unattached? Maybe not. Maybe you're in love with the drama or in love with being in love or you're having trouble moving on and you're upset because she has moved on. So there's so many, there's so many things at play here. I just feel like it's not a road you want to go down. Instead, instead of looking in the past, try to meet new people. And I always say this, come up with a new passion, a new hobby, ways you can meet people, sports leagues, um, community organizations, anything where you can find other people who share your same interests. And it may not be a potential girlfriend or boyfriend. It could be just friends who introduce you to somebody. Just find another avenue, really put your energies in a different direction and move forward and not backwards.